Hey guys, what's up? Hello, friends here. Right, I do apologise that I've not been on most of the month. I've just had a lot of things I had to get organised with myself. That's why I was putting, I was just stuck putting things together and just flew to it and I just didn't stop until I basically wouldn't, was happy when I was doing things. And today I'm showing you my new improved fishing kit. To start off with, this is a fang, no, not fang, fango. This is a viper radio pouch to start off with it is molly capable i do like the idea of repurposing things i did buy this for radio but it was far too big so i repurposed it and to turn it into my fishing kit All right let's begin shall we there i do have a frog gig on the outside i am building pouches or sleeves for these things guys i have a hook remover a knot tire help tire a small net needle and a drill fishing drill and I don't know what the other parts for so I still have my k-bar and in my k-bar is nothing absolutely nothing I am going to I'm sorting out what I want to put in there yet and if you've got any ideas please let me know I do have a pair of these fishing um, secretaries, or whatever you want to call them, and they are attached on to a lanyard, so I don't lose them. I have a fish mouth for a spreader in this kit. And yeah, I know there's multiple uses for that one. And here I have a compact fishing pouch. Oh, yeah, pouch, whatever you want to call it. And then here, I have fishing flies. Yes, they're in straws, because basically I don't want things to go rusty unless I'm going to start using it. And then I have self-weighted hooks with some, some, with some fake bait inside of them. And there is quite a few of them in there, as you can see. I'm going to be adding some more as well, because... I'd want to when I need to in my opinion so yeah that's the main fishing kit I'm gonna start carrying or oh, I want to start carrying I should say not I am starting coming I think personally we should all oh, if you've got a pouch and you don't and it's too big for something try and repurpose it for something else because to me it's something better than buying something new and then something you, you buy something and it don't work out and then you have to go and buy something else and that might not work out so i like to repurpose things so that's what i've done here and here because i had one of these in my cook set i had this in my cook set i had this in my cook set i took it out and put it in my fishing kit i can still use it in my cook set because at the end of the day this is still brand new this is not being used so yeah Ever close this thing there okay guys yeah like my fog gig here i am going to add two screws into this pouch into a, i might add more than two screws into this pouch I might add four maybe add six six or eight or maybe even ten screws just to fit into those holes so basically then i can attach a pole to it and then screw it down and then I'm not trying to work out how, and then work out, I'm not going to go like that. If I don't have to, if I had, say, a four foot pole, even if I had a two foot pole, I'm still going to basically be easier to use this. Like this net needle I've just shown you, that is the perfect size for my fishing net. I don't need anything bigger than that one. I will show you the fishing net because it's in a separate pouch with all my other stuff, the fishing stuff I've got my inch system fishing kit in a different pouch and i'll show you that later on i have this knot tire because i struggle just to tie the fishing knot i don't know why it's just one knot i just really struggle with that's the reason why i put that in and the same as that i put that in because i find it easier to remove hooks from a fish than trying to use my or 
to use them. These are good to have, in my opinion. So, yeah. Right, I'm going to stop here, guys, because it's coming over five minutes. Thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you in the next one. And enjoy the rest of your days. And please stay safe and well. Thank you. Goodbye.